at the last batch of episodes, we come back obviously to an episode that it's called Last Holiday. And so it feels weighted for your characters as their last holiday, not just with, with us, but maybe their last holiday ever. Where am I, am I which- you I, think, I, think, I think you're hitting right around it. So what, what do these celebrations, if that's the right word, look like? In hindsight, I think we'll almost see that episode not only as an homage to the holidays that the boys get to go through uh, and had to miss, uh, but even like the bunker that's become their home. So it's a chance for the boys to kind of enjoy this home that's given them so much and to sort of go like, all right, let's, let's toot our own horns for just a second. You still got to get back to work, but let's go ahead and take a moment to go like, it's like, the, it's like the last breath you take before you're about to do your final sprint or something. And so it's, a, it's kind of a, um, strangely, it's, it's kind of a, a serendipitous welcome back to the final seven episodes because it sort of is a chance of like, all right, everybody take a deep breath. Let's laugh a little bit. Let's see the boys kind of allow someone to give them some praise and let's get work to do. Yeah, there's a little celebratory. Uh, I think it's, it's probably one of those rare moments uh, in the course of the show <clears throat> where we get to see the boys kind of kick their shoes off and, and pat each other on the back and, you know, cheers and say job well done. Uh, but in true supernatural fashion, it doesn't last long. <laughs> right. And we, got, and we got to get back to work. There was an idea you had, maybe you and Jared both, but had for a fun standalone episode that you wouldn't necessarily write, but wanted to say to the writers, hey, maybe consider this. Jared, myself, and Richard Spate, uh, Jr., yeah. we, we went back and forth. We actually have a text thread, and it was just spitballing ideas. Uh, and it was, we called it Naked Supernatural. And not because we're not all clothing, not clothing. Not because we're all, okay. yeah. Not, not we're all, that's where uh, everybody's mind just went. So okay. <laughs> it was it was like the naked gun version of supernatural. Everything is tongue in cheek. Everything is you know uh, any kind of horrible joke that we could possibly fathom. It, it was going to be that version of, of uh, an episode of supernatural. I come um, back to shoot it. I tell you what, if they write it and prove it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Play. And we have some pretty good ideas. I'll have to go through and find them and, and, uh, and, and tell you the next time we talk. But it's, uh, there were enough good ideas that we all thought were like, th if this wasn't the final season of the show, this would be made an episode. I know they made me laugh out loud reading, oh, yeah. you know, like that would be hilarious. It was all the stuff you talk about where you're, you know, you're shooting some deep and dark scene where I think it was during Spate's episode where like killing Loki or whatever. It's like, wouldn't this be funny if blah, 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 And sure enough, we'd all bust out laughing and be like, okay, uh, and get to your marks. You're like, oh, shit. We did a, uh, and I think, I, I believe this was one of the ideas that we had, and we actually did it as a goof, and it'll probably be on the, the, uh, the last episode's blooper reel. Um, but there's a big battle scene, and uh -huh. in rehearsal, or no, it was on camera. Jared yeah. literally just looks at me and just like, gives me the nod and I didn't even really even know what that meant until he immediately just went <laughs> and like, oh we're going super slow-mo and we did the entire fight in super super slow-mo and the crew members are just falling over folded laughing yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, and it was you know but one of the things about doing stunt fights on camera is that if you fight at the same speed you would fight in real life you can't see anything and nothing can see so you have, we have things called like quarter speed, you know, half speed. I was like, that's a little fast also, do a quarter speed. We're like, okay. And so we uh, do quarter speed and they're like, slow down a little bit further. And so I just looked at Jensen and I was like, he knows, he knows. And so sure enough. Now, fun fact for you on that, um, there was, I forget what episode it was, uh, where Sam and Dean are fighting, fighting each other in the, in the Men of Letters. Uh, and Dean throws Sam off the balcony. That particular fight scene, the camera guy couldn't get, couldn't get over just because of, of the way the set was situated yeah. to where my punch was not selling as it didn't look like it was hitting him. There was air. <clears throat> and so I said, okay, I was like, watch this. And I actually slowed it down and literally connected with Jared. And he goes, Bleh! and then they just sped it up in post. So it That's looks right. like I actually hit him. 